Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you my quick and simple morning skincare routine. I like this routine a lot and I wanted to share it with you guys. So I hope you enjoy. So before getting into my skincare routine, I did want to shed some light on the fact that your pillowcases need to be nice and clean for your skincare routine to actually be beneficial. Your pillowcases catch a lot of debris and you just want to make sure that you keep your pillowcases nice and clean. I'm actually using these pillowcases from Louis Silk. I love silk pillowcases so much. They are so good for your skin and not only that but they're also good for your hair especially if you have natural hair like me. It keeps your hair um, nice and intact and you don't have to worry about it really messed up in the morning or it being getting pulled at nighttime when you're sleeping because I personally toss and turn a lot. So these pillowcases in particular, like I said, are from Lily Silk and they're actually very high quality silk pillowcases. So if you guys want to try them out for yourself and you are interested, go ahead and look down in the description box for a discount code because you do get 12% off with my code down below. So yes guys, let's go ahead and jump into the actual skincare routine. So all of the products that I'm going to be using in this video are going to be eco-friendly beauty products that are pretty much indie brands and they're all going to be from the website Navigo.com which is pretty much an online retailer for indie brands, eco-friendly, natural products. So their mission is basically to promote sustainably um, safe and healthy products that are good for the environment and also good for you so I love that type of thing you guys know that I love holistic living and so Navigo was actually nice enough to go ahead and provide a discount code for you guys for 10% off of all the products that I use in this video so step one in my skincare routine is of course to start with cleansing my skin and I'm actually using the Huna skin to cleanse my skin today and this is a cleansing powder um, I actually thought that I wasn't gonna like this just because it was a powder but it actually turned out to be a amazing product all you have to do is add one fourth cup of the powder to a bowl and then add in some water and then it will make your paste for your face so it's kind of like a clay so this powder formula is mostly made from ivory clay, which I thought was amazing. It also has ground coconut and coconut milk powder. So the ivory clay works to detoxify the skin and just bring your skin more cleansing, opening up the pores and just getting all that gunk out of your skin. I also love that it had um, banana in this powder, powder as well, which is very moisturizing to the skin. It's very important to choose a cleanser that is amazing for your skin and that doesn't have a lot of junk in it because you want to um, actually get the junk out so you don't want to put more on your face. So cleansing your face is very important because it moves dirt, oil, and debris. Throughout the day you encounter so many things that continuously attach to your face like bacteria and just things that you don't want to be on your face. So cleansing your face at least daily or every other day um, it's very important and it also removes impurities and gives your skin that natural, fresh, young look that everyone really does want to maintain. I have to be honest and say I did not have much faith in this powder at first when I first seen it and I first tried it. But as soon as you wash off your face, you will see why, why it's an amazing clay. And I've been using it for pretty much every single day because it's so gentle on my face and I just feel comfortable with doing that. So step two in my skincare routine is to go ahead and apply a toner. Today I'm using the Amazonia Vitamin Toner to tone my face. So I absolutely love the packaging, guys. Look at the packaging. It's just, oh my gosh. I've never seen anything so leveled up. That is like amazing packaging. So the formula in this toner is actually formulated to improve circulation and actually balance the skin serum. So it's actually hydrating and it eases the skin appearance of scars which is what you want in your toner um, and also is a four-in-one toner working as a toner anti-aging treatment and a skin clarifier it also is a pore minimizer so you're pretty much covered in a lot of problematic skin areas so i used to think that toning your face was completely pointless um, but it's actually very important toning helps to close your pores and tighten your cell gaps after cleansing your face so you do want to make sure that you apply your toner so you can minimize the 
um, possibilities of impurities getting into your skin. So the third step in my routine is to go ahead and choose a serum. Today I'm using the Frida and Wolf Glow Serum and this is a plant-based serum that contains 100% organic ingredients. Um, choosing your serum is very important because you want to make sure that you're following up with a very moisturizing serum but not one that is going to be too oily especially if you have extremely oily skin. Okay guys, so the last step in my routine is to go ahead and use a face sheet mask. Now I just recently started to use these. I don't use them all the time, but I do use them occasionally. I like the way they feel on my face, so I decided to add it to my routine. But like I said, this is very optional. You can stop at the serum. So I take this J roller that I actually purchased sometime last year, and I actually roll that on my face. I have no idea if I'm using this correctly. I'm still very new to J rolling, but I do know that the benefits of J rolling is out of this world amazing. You guys know that I love crystals and I love the benefits and healing properties of crystals. So I like to just rub it on my face and it just makes my face feel amazing. And I like the way that it has the cooling effect to the face. So I just now took off my sheet mask and you see now that my face is super hydrated. I just take the rest of the essence that's in the sheet mask and I kind of rub it into my face and that pretty much completes that part of my skincare. So I did forget to mention that you can use a anti-aging serum or a cream if you want underneath your eyes um, just because you know, some people like to put that in their routine. So I decided to try it today because the Huna skin was so amazing. I wanted to add in another one of her products. So I am trying that underneath my eyes, even though I already applied a serum, which was the Frida and Woof. But that serum was so light that I felt that it was okay to go ahead and apply a anti-aging serum. Thumbs up to every brand that's in this video. They really did take the time and patience to put these products together. And I just... They really do come through when you actually use them on your skin. So after I'm done with my simple skincare routine, I usually like to follow up with my body care. And I'm using a really, really moisturizing body care today called Oga's Organics Whipped Body Butter. I absolutely love this butter. As you can see, I've been using it like crazy. It's almost gone. I highly recommend this whipped butter it's amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. I cannot say it enough. It's so moisturizing. The main ingredient is shea butter and coconut oil. I love the fact that the ingredients are very simple and straight to the point. Um, and I also like the fact that you can choose a scent. And I actually went with a more summer citrus scent, which is the Orange Dream. So I hope you guys enjoyed my quick skincare routine and I'll see you guys in my next one.